All right, so let's get started. So I'm running this off of my MacBook Pro um, 10.12. So this website, um, I will be providing the link. So what we want to do is run Squidman. So this is the link for the Squidman uh, 3.8. Go ahead and download that. So once you download that, open up Squidman. And then from here, go into Squidman and hit preference. So now go into template. And from here, we'll be um, getting all the template from the pastebin file or the pastebin website. So you can find that here. So click on that. And it'll take you to the uh, pastebin website. So make sure you copy everything from line one down and copy that and save it. So once you save that, uh, here where it says 808, make sure you change it to 8080 once you paste it here into this um, file. So right there, 8080. And this is all the text file that was on that uh, website. And then save it. All right, so now um, what we wanna do is go into your terminal and find your IP address. And if you don't know it, you can type in um, ipconfig uh, grep.init. So once you find your IP address, go into setting, go into network, set up internet connection, and use Wi-Fi. Go to custom. Now we'll show you a list of uh, profile. Mine was AT&T, which is my router. And then what you want to do is hit automatic. Do not specify. I hit the wrong one. Go back. Now hit automatic. Hit automatic. Uh, use for proxy. And then type in your IP address that you found. Mine was 192.168. Dot. Um, one dot. Some number. So once you're done, hit um, done. And then test internet connection. So here, if everything connects successfully, uh, you know you've done it right. Because it's communicating with the, um, your MacBook. All right, so now go back into your library and find PT. And now you can download PT. And you shouldn't be getting any error, so it should be downloaded. All right, so hope this helps. If you find it useful, give me a thumb up. And I'll see you guys later.